Do you want to mix on headphones, but do you hate being attached to a cable? Then don't worry, because a company called AIII has got you covered. Or do they? So these are the wireless studio headphones from AIII, and honestly, the most difficult thing to review is headphones a and also speakers, by the way. And that is because I can talk a lot about it, but I can't really demo it. With all other gear that I review, I can show an example of what the gear is actually doing. But with this, it's, well, impossible to get across and it's also very personal. So usually when I get a review request from a speaker brand or a headphone brand, I say no. However, when I got the request to review these, it was a bit more special because these ones are wireless and low latency wireless. So I said, yeah, send me one of those and I'll take a look at it. And that put me in a bit of a tight spot. More on that later. But let's first talk about the unique features. So the first thing that I found to be really cool about these headphones is that they are fully modular. Uh, not only modular in that you can easily replace parts that are broken or need replacements, but also because you can customize your own headphone. You can really put your own headphone together. Now the model they sent me, this one is called the TMA2 Studio Wireless Plus. And it contains the S05 detailed sound drivers, or at least that's how they describe it. Now this version comes with this thing. Um, it looks a bit like a power bank, but this actually is the wireless transmitter. So if you want to use the low latency uh, wireless feature, you have to connect this thing to your audio interface. And a transmitter like this is really needed for low latency audio because Bluetooth is simply too slow. However, you can use it on Bluetooth and you can also use it with an ordinary cabled connection. So these headphones have a lot of promising and cool features. However, it's marketed as studio headphones. Now, I don't want to start the discussion here about if you need to mix on headphones or not. Uh, I just want to focus on the headphones itself. But um, I am expecting a certain level of quality uh, from the sound that comes from headphones like these because they are for studio usage. And I mean, if they weren't for studio usage, then a low latency uh, transmitter wouldn't come with it. And this is where the problem starts because if you ask me, they don't sound that good they sound pretty bad actually and honestly i am a bit of a spoiled kid i mean that over there those those speakers there that that's my reference but when i listen to the headphones they sound very colored a bit harsh a bit filtered and a bit smeared or something and when using this low latency uh, thing i even noticed a little bit of harmonic distortion as well so those are all things that i don't really want from headphones now, again, this is all very personal, but I want to describe in some way what I was actually hearing and experiencing. And I want to stress out that this is not a scientific way or a precise way or whatever. I just made this on ear, but I've made a filter to describe my experience with these headphones just to get the point across a bit better. Because, again, it's very difficult to review headphones and to show how I'm experiencing them. So again, take this with a little bit of a grain of salt, but I think when listening to this demo, you will understand my point a bit better, hopefully.
All right, so I hope that point comes across. These sell for 350 euros. So honestly, it's maybe a little bit of what you can expect for that price point. I don't know. I, I wouldn't really use them for some serious studio work. That's just what I think. Uh, and honestly, I don't find the sound very comfortable. So I also wouldn't use them just on Bluetooth to listen to music, but that's more a personal preference. Um, but for studio work, I don't think they're really uh, suited for that. However, I do think that AIII is a very uh, promising company. And most of all, because they have like the custom headphone builder that you can like replace parts on it and that kind of stuff. I, I find that to be a good thing, but I do think that there is uh, a lot more development needed before these headphones can really be a unique product. I don't think that the feature of having low latency monitoring uh, outweighs the bad audio quality. I actually think that nothing really outweighs uh, bad audio quality. <laughs> Actually, audio quality is just, you know, the most important thing. So yeah, that's what I think. Normally I would invite you all to, to form your own opinion. But again, with a product like this, you first have to buy it before you can listen to it. So it's all very difficult. And it's like, uh, th these are the hardest videos for me to make. So I hope you all can understand. Now, as always for the disclosure, um, they've sent me uh, these headphones and I'm allowed to keep them. Uh, because um, it, it's kind of a hygiene product, I understand that. Uh, they don't need this this one back. However, I'm also not going to use it. Um, so I don't really see an added benefit of being allowed to keep it. I'll probably give them away to a family member or something, uh, uh, people that, that, you know, enjoy the sound of this. Um, I won't. The company is not paying me anything to make this review or whatever. And everything that I'm saying is my complete, honest and independent opinion. If you appreciate that, make sure to support me using my affiliate links. I'll link Toman over here and Sweetwater over here. And if you use my affiliate link when buying something in one of those shops, a little bit of your purchase gets kicked back to me. So make sure to do that. Also, make sure to check out my memberships. I'll link my Patreon campaign over here. You can become a member on Patreon or you can become a member on YouTube, uh, whatever suits you best. It's the same content. And I'll link one of my membership playlists over here. Thanks a lot for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and stuff and like and comment and whatever. Keep pushing and bye bye.